Hey everybody, welcome back to Magic Orthodoxy. My name is David and this is a Magic Review. Hey, today we're gonna look at tactical from the team down at Magic World. What is Tactical? Tactical is a card transformation. Uh, it's a warp, it's a visual change that allows you to change uh, a mini deck of cards into a full-size deck of cards. Or, there's a special bonus handling, you could transform a Tic Tac box into a full-size deck of cards. Do you wanna see the trailer? Of course you do. All right, so that was Tactical. Uh, this was being brought to you by the good people down at Magic World. A couple questions we always ask about all of our Magic reviews, and the first of which is, what's in the box? What's in the box? You're getting a little tiny uh, paper puff package. Okay, it's made to kind of keep air around it uh, because the inside contents are pretty delicate. You're gonna get two gimmicks, okay? You're gonna get two gimmicks. You're gonna get this small deck gimmick and you're gonna get the Tic Tac gimmick. Both of them are constructed for you. One of them, is completely constructed. So one of them will be completely constructed, ready to go. The second one will be 50%, 85%-ish constructed for you, and you will have to finish the construction on it. You will also receive some material, some special gimmick material, uh, to complete the construction and so that you could do gimmick repair in the future should your gimmicks break. And you'll get the download code to the 23-minute video. Is it what I thought? Uh, yes and no. I mean, there was one element to the effect that I could see right away in the trailer uh, that was necessary. It wasn't part of the gimmick, but it was necessary. I saw that part, but the other element, the main part of it, uh, I, could, I didn't actually guess straight on from watching the trailer, so it was a nice surprise. How are the angles? Uh, the angles for this are gonna be the same as another effect. I don't know if you know Blink. Blink came out a long time ago from JB Magic. Uh, it was a Mark Mason effect um, before Alakazam. Uh, I am old enough, <laughs> I'm old enough, to have had Blink in the past. So I had Blink, uh, so I was kind of familiar with this style of gimmick. The gimmick effect itself, the, the base of it, right, the base of it is a classic in card magic. Um, but how Magic World solved this puzzle, how they uh, put this all together, definitely draws inspiration from a couple of different venues, one of which is Blink, but uh, they definitely did borrow from some other effects to create this. So the angles, the angles, to get back to angles, <laughs> the angles will be the same though uh, for Blink. So if you're already familiar with that, the angles are the same. So there are some angle issues, but it's more time sensitive than it is angle sensitive, okay? so. It should look good from all angles, maybe, except for not from behind you. Obviously, you don't want people behind you. But um, I think if you do the trick at speed, you'll diminish your angles incredibly. All right, so what's the overall quality and production value with the video? Uh, the video seems to have been shot uh, pretty fast and haphazard. Uh, you got two instructors at the very beginning. Um, they're just sitting on a couch in some sort of street shop, some street store, and they're right by the window that 
you know, enters out onto the street. So you can clearly see traffic in the background zooming by all the time, so that was a little distracting. And you can hear the traffic. So the camera's picking up all the traffic noise. Do you hear that? And then your instructors aren't even mic'd, because there's two of them, and they're probably filming with one camera, so they can't use two mics. And the camera's just mounted on a tripod, so you're not getting any close-up shots. So it's kind of echoey, they're not mic'd, you only have the one shot, you can hear traffic from outside. Uh, and then on top of that, it seems like they cut, they did their cuts, they did their editing really quickly. So there's really no good transitions between one shot and the next. Sometimes the, the edit happens in mid sentence. So it just, it left a little to be desired. All right, so what's taught on the download? On the download, you're gonna receive the inspiration behind the effect, obviously. Uh, you'll receive the construction of the effect. So how you can make the second gimmick and then repair additional gimmicks. You'll get a performance, obviously, of both uh, of both transformations. You'll learn some additional handling. So let's say you don't like the, tr the handling that they show you, they'll show you some different ones. And they'll even show you a little behind the scenes of how they film the commercial. There are some transitions, there are some changes that happen in the commercial that aren't actually the effect. So to be all cards on the table, they show you how they did some of those transformations, but they were done with camera magic, they weren't done with the effect. Is it well made? Uh, the one you get, that's made is well made, but you'll have to build the other one. How much practice does this require? Um, it's pretty simple as far as the moves go, okay? So as far as there being slights or anything like that, that part's simple. The part that you'll need to practice is the timing. You wanna make sure this timing looks right so that when the transformation happens, it's not clumsy, it's not fumbly, you know, it, it happens nice and clean so that all the spectators receive the same effect. Especially if you're gonna do this on camera, you definitely wanna make sure your timing was right on so that people couldn't actually stop or slow down or pause the frame rate to see where the transformation takes place. So there are some timing things with this routine. Like I said, it's not hard, it's not hard, but the timing does need to get practiced. How much setup and reset is there? Again, I'm gonna refer back to Blink with Mark Mason. Uh, very minimal setup and reset, it's super easy. Positives, all right, so what are the positives to Tactical? Tactical is a hyper visual change that allows you to grab your audience's attention in the very first few seconds. You'll be getting applause before the routine has even started with this one. Negatives, all right, so what are the negatives to Tactical? You know, like we say around here, there's negatives to everything. These are just the negatives that I see. They don't have to be the negatives that you see. Um, really the negative for me, and it was just a negative for me, this won't be a negative for you at all, actually, because when I received mine, it wasn't complete. So I received two gimmicks that were identical. I didn't get the Tic Tac gimmick, and both of my gimmicks needed DIY. So if you've watched my channel for any amount of time, you know I hate DIY, I hate it. So <laughs> to get two gimmicks that were identical and they both needed DIY, uh, that I wasn't, I wasn't in love with that. Plus, there is a little element to it where you do need to wear specific clothing. The guys from Magic World will tell you you don't need to wear specific clothing, and they do give you handlings uh, for additional ways to do it however it's better okay it's better and easier if you wear the correct clothing so I think that makes it a little restrictive is it worth your money uh, it's 30 bucks 30 bucks and you get two handmade gimmicks plus a 23 minute video it's definitely in the ballpark definitely worth your money who would like this all right so who would like this I think people that do street magic this is built for you it's a great opener it gets people's attention and when you do street magic or when you do strolling, or when you do walk around, you know, table hopping, you wanna be able to get people's attention right away because either they're eating, or they're walking, or they're going from one place to the next, and you wanna grab their attention immediately so they stop and watch what you're doing. That's, good, that's a great trick for getting audience attention, so I think this will definitely speak your language. All right, so that's my review for Tactical from Magic World. I wanna thank the team down at Murphy's Magic Supplies for allowing me to have this effect so that I could do the review for you. And if you would like to purchase it for yourself, you can find it from your very favorite Murphy's Magic dealer. Thanks. Bye.